Welcome to 813 Gardens. My name is Ed. Please take a second to like the video, comment, and most important, subscribe. It's been a while since we started this gardening project, but I think we're starting to get somewhere. Take a look. If you look closely, we have peppers. Peppers everywhere. See that right there? So most of our plants have peppers now. Got some more tucked under here. So this table right here, most of what you're seeing is, um, those are habanero plants. And this one right here is a red pep bell pepper plant. It's got some maturing to do, but it's coming along. It's coming a long way. This one right here, this bushy wild child, is a cream sugar rush. Do a video with that too when those come out. Right now it's just got a bunch of buds, but no, no peppers. These are our basil plants. They're struggling some, but they've been good to us, and they seem to keep coming back over and over again. So I'm sure they'll come back. And there's more peppers here. This table's got a mix of sweet peppers, hot peppers, super hot peppers, and a few habaneros mixed in there too. Like that guy right there. And chili peppers too. These guys are small, but this plant produces a ton of these things just keeps producing these, these small bright red chili peppers and this guy right here is a scotch bonnet so we have a few plants on our patio you can see here's another scotch bonnet loaded with peppers all things considered our plants are a bit smaller, so you'll see some people with plants that have 50, 100 peppers on them. Not yet. And this is another habanero. Hasn't bloomed yet. Another habanero. Take a look at that guy. bright yellow. There's a couple more over there. And we got a few more in here. This guy right there. And as we go out the patio, we got a few plants here. These are just extras. I decided to put them in the ground and see what happens. They got a lot of nutrients, so I'm sure they're gonna probably produce pretty good. Continuing on the side of the house, more pepper plants. Same mix, some scotch bonnets, some habanero, a few different other types of peppers. But for the most part, the scotch bonnets and the habaneros are the ones that have come up so far. get down further. These are the struggling plants. Spend a lot of time every day trying to nurse these and make them better. And um, they'll get there. Just gonna take a little time. 
And on the other side, uh, we have just a few more plants. So these in particular were small plants that we've been nursing for a while. So I decided to put two, uh, two pepper plants in one pot and see what happens. So these are being fertilized on a regular basis and cared for. And some of them have peppers in them. They're small, but they're still peppers. And we put these on this side of the house because we just ran out of space. I think at last count, we had 67 pepper plants. So, next month is going to be fun. It's going to produce a lot of food. And we're looking forward to it. So, that's a tour of our pepper garden. Probably post some more videos as we get more peppers and we get more color in the peppers. Thanks for watching. Peace out.